I'll be back with Keys Keenum. And Keenum, a guy, he's seen his fair share. Now a first down throw. Keenum throwing the out route incomplete. It's Quinn. And from the 25, they work this to the 29. NFL kicks off its 2019 season. I kick off my 2019 season with the Eagles as they do in real life. I've been doing this for the last six years. Um, Trent Williams is not going to be playing on the point because they got him on that reserve list. Doesn't mean he's out for the season. I think he's just going to play for his game. He's injury. Um, Nathan Gary, the linebacker, will take over for Phil Cool. Drew Wilmore Hill, I'm sorry if I said his name wrong. Uh, he's out with the injury. But other than that, the Eagles are coming into this game relatively healthy. Uh, Brandon Brooks looks like he's going to start. He's cleared to play from the doctor, so you're going to see him in the game. I try to give you the most realistic highlights you're going to see. I don't do computer versus computer. I try to give you the most realistic depiction of what you see on TV is what you get in my gameplay. So at the end of this video, I'll come in at the end and give you my final predictions. Watch the whole video. This end out turn to be a really good game. Oh, he's got a man wide open, complete. And he's got this down to the 35. Throwing his Keenum on third down. Eagle pressure, too much this time. They go with Howard to begin the drive. And he gets this one just shy of the four. Lefty, lefty. Three down, three down. Throwing on first is Wentz. Jackson's got it over the middle. And he's got hey, Alpha. Don't be scared of it. Done. Now Wentz on third down. Jeffrey with a catch left side. First down, Wentz. He's checking for this. They'll run it with Spoles. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Complete pass. From the gun, here's Keenum. That'll be caught right side by Reed. And he's going to lose yards. They finally draw a beat on you. Maybe you mix it up a little bit, a little play action, and throw the ball. Then will they maintain that balance? Time to find out. Now Sanders. And he gets this one just shy of the 40. They'll mark him down. He's probably on the next tier. But let me tell you something. He becomes more consistent and continues. And the ball is knocked out. And the Redskins scoop it. And some room to work. And they will finally put it into the return. The back into the end zone, the sideline. And he fights his way into the end zone for a Redskin touchdown. 46 down, man, 5-4. From the 36, Wentz. And complete to Zach Ertz. And able to get... 81, 81. Now it's Sproles. And past the 35, he'll be dropped. But I really enjoyed watching how the defense stayed in sync, stayed in great communication. And as he dragged across each zone, you see him pointing, communicating. What can they do here on fourth down? They'll run it, Sanders. And he has it. Now they'll throw it. Wentz. And he'll take it into the end zone for an Eagles touchdown. Give their defense a chance to settle down a little bit after they give up a touchdown. Looking to throw again on second down. Keenum. Brown with a stick skills. And they take possession. Watch the ship. Watch the ship. Throwing his wins. And this is caught at the eight. And they do get him down. On first and goal, Howard. And he's in. Touchdown, Eagles. Touchdown. Taking it in from four yards out for six points. And that's going to be a tough one for the defense to deal with. They've got to go to the bench now and figure out. First round went to the offense, second round the defense. To throw is Keenan. And this is going to be incomplete. Them unable to do so on that play. And this won't get there. Won't be online either. It's no good. Just a few inches here on third. Play action to Sproles. Wins. He lets this one fly toward the back of the end zone. And this is intercepted, but they'll say out of bounds. Ocean here on third down. Throwing now is Keenum. Now he'll dump it underneath to his running back. Complete. Let's go, baby. 
This is critical to the passing attack is a lot of receivers, tight ends, because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big plays for an offense. We're doing a little bit more. Offensive linemen and tight ends, they're expected to block. But the wide receivers, all they want to do is catch passes. So when they block on a big-time running play and create extra coverage as well. I love how you put it together. The front and back working in... Working from the gun, Wentz. And he connects with Ertz. And they're able to get this one across the third and eight. Now Wentz. He's going to let this go for the end zone. And that'll wind up incomplete. Change ups. We're going to see him when we kick it off in the second half. See how they handle any adjustments that might be made defensively. And shutting him off now open field. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40. What's that? Wentz off the fake handoff to Howard. Right side caught by Jackson. And he's a long ways into Washington territory before hitting the turn. Now on second and 13, Wentz. He'll be hit and taken down at the 21. From the gun, it's Wentz. And this is caught. At the they discussed how they were going to get that done. This is where scripting comes into play a lot how, of the how time. How many plays do you script coming out of the second? Most, most of the time in the first. And down he goes. Keenum is sacked. Fletcher Cox. Last level being the secondary. But if the strong safety position ended up making the tackle, and oftentimes. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked off by Sidney Jones. And he takes this one back into the end zone. And the Eagles defense gets... They start the drive with Peterson. Adrian Peterson, 30, the 20, 10, touchdown, Washington. Adrian Peterson, 81. Push him back, right? They'll let Peterson try and run it in. And he'll get two. A shotgun snap for Keenan. He's going to float this one deep. And he's going to be intercepted a third time. Picked off by Ronald Darby. Go, go, go. On first and ten, it's Clement. Shedding the tackle and it gives him some room. And he's going to get the black. On play action, Wentz lost the football, and his guys are going to get the football at the... Hey, let's tip the cap to the defense here. Not a problem at all, my man. I'm not even going to tip it. I'm going to doff my cap to him. Congratulations. Big time play. Knocking it free and creating... It's like he's one of them, and they really embrace him. Throw right side caught by Davis. A pickup after a play like that. He might reduce and might go to the corner and just grab a hot dog or two, huh? Hey, I mean, they still been blocking fell. It seemed like everyone was using it. But it has been scaled back considerably in the last few seasons. And he's going to be taken down, sacked back around the 18 yard line. It's on third down. Working from the gun, Keenan. To the goal line, but it's incomplete. Hopkins' kick is good. And the drive will wind up yielding. That's that good arrogance, believing you can run the football whenever you get good and ready. Now a quick slant as the throw is complete. And he gets this. From the gun, it's Keenum. That's brought in by Davis over the middle. And he has another. And Hopkins' kick is good. They can't touch the ball. They go with Howard to begin the drive. And they'll get it up just short of the 45. On first, they go right back to Howard. Fighting. Now Howard stripped. He lost the football. And the Redskins scoop it. And he's into the clear. 20. And he is into the end zone for a Washington touchdown. Moving again. How can we get our team going? This definitely qualifies. 
one score game. Now a play fake here on first down. Four down, and he can't find a receiver, and he's brought down. Montez. And trust your defense and make sure you take care of the ball and punt it away. What kind of options do you have here, and what do you trust more on your team? Yeah, they may have just pushed him back into that throw. Go freaking check one up. Keenum to Thompson on the screen. And he'll be taken down for a little bit. feel there's a sense of urgency for them going on offense right now. But they have to do it without letting panic creep in and affect their play. And they'll get him down. So third to the 28 for a first. He's checking. He's Ryan Lyon. Crash, crash. Throwing his wins. And that is incomplete. This is air because that's a completion he makes, what, 9.9 .9 times out of 10? Just missed that Something to build off of. That's what they're looking for here. <laughs> Throwing on first down is Keenan. Pressure from his right, and he goes down hard, flat on his back. Great job of him holding on after absorbing that big hit. Now a third down throw, but it misses the target in the season in order to continue to carry the ball at this rate. <laughs> On first down, Wentz. Throwing the out route incomplete. It's Jackson. Yet at the same time, not going so fast as to leave too much time on the clock. From the 29, Wentz letting one go deep for the end zone. Back of the end zone, could he get his feet? Check 53. Hey, Lou, 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 Lou. Get in the right room. Watch safety three. Watch safety three. Now Wentz on third down. And he connects with Ertz. And they're going to have another first down here as the tackle's made at the Redskins 17-yard line. Oh, score, and this game's over. Second and five now. Wentz, and it's not big of a deal to me, and I'm going to keep firing. Working from the gun, Wentz. Got him in, open, it's Ertz. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Zach Ertz. So the failure to connect on second down, that leaves him staring up here at a third and eight. And Davis has it over the middle. And he'll be tackled right on the chalk. And let's see how this plays out. Keenum going to throw. Throwing the out route incomplete. That's Davis. And they keep the game alive, at least for the moment, as it's a first. And down he goes. Keenum is... I'm picking the Eagles to win this game against the Redskins. The Redskins offensive line is not the same without Trent Williams. I like the Eagles defensive line against the Redskins offensive line. And I like the Eagles offensive line against a pretty good Redskins front. I like the Eagles to win a 27-13 matchup against the Redskins. Hopefully they don't play defense as bad as I did against the run in this game.